Okay, so mm. we're back. Hello. We're cooking again. Yeah. We're on the Ninja Wood Fire. Hello. And we're going to do something really, 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 really special. I've been looking forward to this all day ever since you told me. Really summery, mm -hmm. really different. Mm -hmm. And we're going to use mm -hmm. the um, air fryer part of the Ninja Wood Fire. Okay, one now, question. Yes. Sweet or savoury? This is sweet. Good. This is definitely sweet. Good. And and I know we're going to use the um, air fryer version of the Ninja Wood Fire. Mm -hmm. And I know thousands and millions and millions and billions and hundreds of trillions of people. Just a few then. Just a few. Mm -hmm. Have got mm -hmm. um, uh, air fryers. What, you mean the ones you use inside? In the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. But the difference here is we can do this outside. Yeah. On our ninja wood fire. Perfect. And I think this is really a lovely thing. If you've got people around for the afternoon, mm -hmm. and you're having tea or you've had a barbecue, towards the end of the day you could do this. And what we're going to do mm -hmm. is we are going to cook mm -hmm. some apple scones mm -hmm. and then serve them up mm -hmm. with sour cream and honey. It's like a honey marble that's stirred through the sour cream. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. and it is absolutely beautiful. It's just, I know it's another version of the scone, and then you, do you have the cheese? Not the cheese. Um, do you have the cream or do you have the jam? Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah, is yeah. going to be mm -hmm. an apple scone, which is going to be relatively sweet to start with, mm -hmm. and then a little bit of sour cream on it mm -hmm. that gives a bit of, you know, sort of, because it's not sour, but it's not cream, and then you've got that honey push through it, mm -hmm. and I think it's going to be an absolute winner. Good, excellent. Right, so, what do we do first? First of all, we need to warm this baby up. Okay. Okay, so we need to turn this on mm -hmm. to air fry. Displays yeah. come on. That's supposed to be flicking because yeah. of the video. It actually so, says temp 200 and time 20, is yeah, that currently right? Yeah, currently 200. And we actually want a temperature of 180. Right. Is this the same as like a, an oven? Yes. Okay. Yeah, very similar. Okay. But it's mm -hmm. only going to take 12 minutes to cook them in this, okay. which is absolutely amazing. So I'm going to reduce that down to 12. Are we going to do it on the, like the, 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 oh God. No, we're the doing it in mat. the stir fry, not the stir fry, oh. the air fry tin. Okay. You just put the scones in there. Okay. Okay. That's okay. all you do. You'll see. All right, that's it's okay. It's as simple as that. Then we hit the button. We haven't used the air fry tin before yet. We haven't noticed no, the no. first time for okay. us. Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah. Okay. And we're outside again mm -hmm. at the caravan mm -hmm. in Hon Stanton mm -hmm. in the sun. Mm -hmm. We've just got through a watery downpour of thunder and lightning. Yeah, it has been We've very We've got thunder. Boomer Bear down here. Hello, Bums. Who's just also had a shower because he was running around on the beach. <laughs> and he's a bit warm in the sun, but... That's his fault, not yeah. ours, because uh -huh. he can go in. Yeah. Anyway, back to this. Uh -huh. So we're going to put, we're going to start it, and then it's going to start warming up. Okay. And in that period of warming up, mm -hmm. we are going to make the scones. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to hit that. That's going to say pre whatever it means, you know, pre heat, right. pre warm, okay. you know, pre love, yeah, just pre everything, yeah, and that will. Go beep, beep, beep once yeah. that's ready. But in the meantime, okay. we're going to do our scones. And this is such a simple recipe. Now, am I right in thinking that last time when you cooked anything on it, yes. if you pick the lid up, it sort of resets its timery type yes, thing? Yes, it does. We're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. I'm going to trust it. You're going to trust 100%. it? 100%. Right. And if it burns... Yes, it's its we, fault. It's its fault, not my fault. <laughs> okay. right. This is the first time we've done this. Okay. It's, it's, it's not my fault. Never. No. no. Okay. If anybody's fault, it's somebody else's. <laughs> <laughs> Don't they often say a poor workman often blames his tools? Yeah, but I'm not a poor workman. Okay, I'm that's a very right. healthy workman. Okay, carry on. Right. right. Okay. Easy, easy recipe. Okay. 200 grams of self raising it's, it's easy for you to say. Yeah. Self-raising flour. Okay. And a good <gasps> teaspoonful of baking powder. Okay. Okay. Pop that into your bowl. Mm -hmm. So simple. Mm, so far, so good. 75 grams of butter mm -hmm. chopped into chunks. Mm -hmm. Make sure that comes out of the fridge. Okay. So you don't need it soft. Oh, okay. okay. I would I would usually sort of stick it in a microwave or something. Yeah, but you would, but you wouldn't. But you can't. It's not allowed. Oh, okay. And then we've got... Is there a reason? Is there a reason? Sorry. Well, I think because you... No, okay. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Is it because it's colder? Yes. Yeah. 
<laughs> you are funny. Carry on. And then we've got 70 millilitres of milk. Okay. You don't use all the milk. You just add it to make sure you get it all binding together. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Um, so sometimes you might need a bit more. Mm -hmm. Try and save some back so you can glaze the top of your scones before you do it. Okay. Okay. And then we've got some apple. And I've already chopped the apple up. And I've mm. chopped it into about sort of half centimetre squares. Mm -hmm. The size of your little fingernail mm -hmm. no yep mm -hmm. and i've used eating apples not cooking apples mm -hmm. because eating apples are a little bit more sweeter mm -hmm. and i don't want to put sugar in this okay because we've got all sorts of flavors and tastes going mm -hmm. on okay? okay and then all we need to do with clean hands is just pull this together okay? oh it's like what i used to do is cooking at it's school. very simple it's very <laughs> much like doing a crumble Okay. But what you want to do is end this up, not necessarily into crumbs, you want it in flakes. Mm. And, and the whole idea, if you have that butter um, chilled before you start, mm -hmm. is it's not going to go into a mush. So you can see there, just bringing that into like flakes with the thumb and the back of the fingers there. Like that. Why do you use self-raising and not plain flan? Because it tells you on the recipe. <laughs> Oh, seriously, do you know? <laughs> do you know what? I haven't got a foggiest. <laughs> oh, look, it's oh. telling me to add food now. So because we've been chatting, yeah. we've been behind. But it'll hold that maintenance. Well, I hope it'll hold that temperature until we've done this. But it shouldn't take us long. Right? Perhaps somebody can tell me in the comments below yeah. why you use self-raising oh, and not playing. I imagine it's got something like some sort of raising agent in it has okay. it i don't know well, why do we add baking powder then because it's extra oh okay <laughs> i All really right. don't know i can understand adding baking powder to plain flour i'm not a modern day chef okay Fair anyway enough. so that's that mm -hmm. now i'm going to get the apple mm -hmm. and i'm going to pop the apples in there okay okay but before i do that i'm going to drain like i say you can't I'm put the water, the water in can off you? the apple yeah but to do that i'm just going to put it on pause and we'll come back to and it and then you're going to wash your hands again i'm going to wash my hands absolutely okay while he's gone, I thought I'd say hi. Look, look at the little fella. He's spread out there now, look. Waiting for his dinner underneath the table. <laughs> Bless him. Aww. Okay, so drain the apple off. Mm -hmm. I've just put it into um, a piece of kitchen paper there. Mm -hmm. And, well, it's a very heavy duty serviette just to take the excess moisture away, mm -hmm. okay? And then I'm just going to quickly mix that into that scone mix, just like that, mm -hmm. like that. Make a well, <laughs> pour in most of the milk, but not all of it. Are you using your yeah. knife? I'm gonna use this knife, because okay. this isn't a sharp knife, mm -hmm. and just bring that together. Hopefully that will be enough moisture in there to bring that. I shall obviously use my hands eventually. But you can see what it looks like. To get an idea. I'm just going to try and bring that together. It's very easy. I thought baking that sort of stuff was more difficult. You mean that. scones and things? Yeah. I suppose it's... It's confidence, isn't it? It's all about what you do, how you do it, mm -hmm. and preparing. Mm -hmm. You know, if you've got everything ironed out, not ironed out, weighed out, mm -hmm. um, before you start, then, you know, there shouldn't be a problem. Now, that is a good consistency, okay? Not going to fall apart then, no. Shouldn't do, no. Okay. All right, and then what we're going to do... Mm -hmm. Pop that onto the board. Mm -hmm. What we need to do is just push that out. Trying to do that into an oblong. Right. Yeah. Where I can then cut it mm -hmm. into six equal squares. Okay. All right. Any particular reason why you're not sort of like making little round round bubbles and stuff because these aren't traditional okay. scones mm -hmm. right so i reckon that's about six equal mm -hmm. so i'm just going to cut it like that yeah actually that'd be a lot easier than trying to mold little round things as well won't it with the apple i'm not going to leave them square oh why because i'm just going to sort of like just pat it down like that oh, okay that's all try and bring that together mm -hmm. just pat it down they're not meant to look um 
Perfect. Okay. That's good because I don't. <laughs> there you go. Thank you very much. That's all right, dear. That's all right. See that? That's the apple scones. Mm-hmm. And I'm just going to take a little dip of the milk. Mm-hmm. Put it on to the top. Okay. Like that. Mm-hmm. Oh, sun's coming out beautifully now. Up. Bear with me a second. Look at that look. Isn't that lovely. That look at lovely sun. Looks perfect. Okay. Yeah. Can we come back here? Sorry. Um, hmm. Just wiping right, there we go. some of that excess off my hands. You're going to go and wash them again yet? Not yet, but okay. I will do. Okay. So I'm just going to pull the lid up, drop those scones. Mm, it's really quite warm. Into there. Mm -hmm. One, two, Three, four, five, six. Mm -hmm. Close the lid. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And it started. Oh, well, look, yeah, it's so, the countdown. So we've started the countdown. Mm -hmm. We're 11 minutes and 53 seconds. Yeah. 12 minutes time. That yeah. will go beep, beep, beep. Yeah. Hopefully, we're uh -huh. going to have some nice apple scones okay so while that's cooking yep. you're going to clear up yes i'm going to clear up and wash my hands and prepare the prosecco the prosecco yes and oh, sorry. the sour mm. cream with the honey can't we just can't we just put the sour cream on the top and then drizzle the honey no. on top okay Yeah, but which, no. which do you have on top and which do you have underneath? Isn't That's why I'm doing a marble of honey within the sour cream. All oh, right, so there's no arguments then. No, absolutely. All right. right. Um, we'll let that cook. Yep. And we'll come back to you when we're ready. Okay. Okay, ta-da! All clean, look. Yeah. Perfect. Now then, um, we're going to serve it up with some Prosecco. <laughs> oh, lovely. Yeah, because it's always nice. Now, the Prosecco, we're mm. trying out little quite a lot at the moment, aren't we? Mm, mm. The Prosecco. £5.69 a bottle. Mm. So I've got no idea what that's going to taste like, but I bet it's going to be something pretty nice. And we're going to serve it up in, look at those glasses. Mm. Lakeland. Yeah. All our glasses and... All plastic. Plastic. Have a sip of that, Mrs T. I will. And tell me what that tastes like. Oh, it's okay. It's, very, it's quite sweet. Is it? Mm. But then having said that, all Prosecco at the moment is sweet, isn't it? There we go. Hello. It's nice for a sunny day. Mm, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So that's good. Um, just in case people keep asking, where do we get mm, our plates mm. from? These are from IKEA. Yeah. Look, Denby. They look look yeah. expensive. Yeah. But they're IKEA, yeah. and they're really, really cool. The only problem with them, I feel, yeah. The only problem with them, I feel, is they're quite heavy. They are. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Um, you know, so they're, they're no good for touring caravans because obviously you end up with so much. Um, so much um, weight in your van, yep. that, whatever. So that's, um, but now we're in a static, obviously we can have the, the heavier stuff. But I always find it's really heavy when I'm washing up. Right, so what are we going to do here? Mm -hmm. We're going to take, we've got some British sour cream. Absolutely, you can get this from any supermarket. But you got this again from... This was from Lidl. Yeah. Not expensive. I'm no. Not do it all. I was really shocked, actually, when you went shopping at Lidl um, yesterday. Because um, we haven't really done Lidl before, have we? No. And everything's so much more cost-effective. I won't say cheaper. No, more cost-effective. Yes. Um, better value. Yeah. Um, it's not all your big brands, but I, I'm not preaching. Everybody knows this. Mm. Then, mm. this is the secret for this, you don't need a lot, you just need a little bit of honey in there, mm. just like that, mm -hmm. and just stir it in. Don't need to absolutely make sure it's all in there. Well, I suppose if you had too much honey in there, yeah. that would make it sort of like... And that, now, I think, mm. if you could taste a million pounds, right. this is what it would taste like. Amazing. Right, turn the camera around. Honestly. Oh. Here you go. If you could taste a million pounds, that's what it tastes like. Now, don't tell me that does not taste the best. What do you mean? What was lovely. <laughs> You're not convincing. No, actually. It's not, I know it says sour cream. But it's not sweet. But with that honey no, in actually, it... Actually, yeah, you're right. It's, it's a bit like taking the first glass of Prosecco. Cheers. 
Are we done? Mm. But can you see what I'm saying with the with the sour cream? Mm. You could do it with creme fraiche, you could do it with fresh cream. But I think with sour cream, it just gives it a different taste. Actually, it does. It is nice. Yeah. Can I have some more? Yeah, of course you can. Just Thank a little. You. It's only us for a week, yeah. I'm double living. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's nice. And I bet with that, um, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm looking for Are you there? Yeah, because that smells gorgeous, by the way. Is it the butter? I, can I think it's the butter you can okay. smell in mm. that, yes. Yeah, How absolutely. Much time have we got? We've got one minute 40 seconds. So you take the camera back. Oh, gosh, hang on. Can I put that on there? Yeah, yep. you take that back. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. And in one minute and 30 seconds' time, we're going to get those out. I'm going to move that over there because it's out <clears throat> of the sun. Mm -hmm. I'm getting quite warm here as well. Mm. It is very nice here. Considering that literally mm. 10 minutes ago it was like a, you know, a oh, we did have a thunderstorm. thunderstorm. It's yeah. really, really thundery. Yeah, if you actually look oh. over behind, oh, me. Mm. over there, oh yeah. You see how black the clouds are there. Yeah, they were very yeah, black. Very nice. Anyway. Well, it's nice actually being here. It is. Because we've got all the lovely greenery around the yep. back of the van. Really nice. Yeah, we're very, very lucky. We are very lucky. Okay. In many, 55 many, many, many together. ways. So these should be cooked, uh, hopefully not browned or 49, 48. Mm -hmm. um, the only thing that concerns me, yeah. will they have stuck to that pan? Enabling me to have to wash the ruddy yeah. thing again. So, so oh, but, okay. but again, this is trial and error. Yeah. We might have to put a barbecue thingy in there. Yeah. But then would that not then mean the air circulates for the air fry? I don't know, but so, you look like a windmill sometimes. Do I? <laughs> <laughs> it's got to be Woody, Go away. Woody Windy Miller. <laughs> yeah, stop it. <laughs> um, but yeah, so here we go, 19 seconds. Mm -hmm. We're going to see what they're like. This is live. Oh, well done. We've never done this before. No. We've never trolled it before. We've no. never cooked this recipe before. No. Something that I've thought up. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah. When it's cooking, you can really smell the butter mm. being cooked. One second. Here we go. Okay. I'm dreading this. Are you? <laughs> oh. Oh, look at that. Don't they look nice? Don't they just? Oh, they do they look like proper scones. Oh. It hasn't stuck. Wow. Oh, I'm impressed with that. Well done. That's the one I thought would break. Yeah, why? Why is that? Yeah, I didn't really bind that one properly. Okay. Let's go under. Look at that the buttery smell coming mm, from there. It's lovely. It is absolutely I'm phenomenal. I'm impressed with that. And that was so easy to make. It was, yeah. There we go. They are going to be so hot at the moment mm -hmm. to eat. Mm -hmm. So I would say we'll just leave them 10 minutes outside here and then see how warm they are and then serve them up with some of that honey and some of that sour cream. Mm. Oh, what did that mean? Oh, it says it's done. done. Turn that off. Cool. Mm. Okay. So put it on pause. Mm -hmm. We'll come back in 10 minutes. Mm. Okay, right. We're ready. Mm hmm. So, let's pick one for you. Let's go for that one, yes. Mm -hmm. um, see how it cuts? Oh, it's very crumbly. Is that because it's a bit too warm still, do you think? Um, it's very warm inside, yeah. Okay, well, okay. use this one as an experiment. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, possibly leave it a bit longer. Yep. It's nicely cooked, though, look. Mm. And you've got that apple in there. Mm. And then... Take some of that. Mm -hmm. Marbled honey, sour cream yeah. stuff. Actually, looks very nice. Dollop that on the top. Mm -hmm. And then give me the phone. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to eat. And I'm going to. Oh, it's very warm. That's, so that's Mrs. very Mrs. That was in the sun. Oh, right, okay. Mrs. T, what do you think of these? Mm. Apple scones made on the Ninja wood fire. With some fresh, sorry, sour cream and honey. Oh, that's in the lovely. Actually. No, I've got them. Mm. Oh, it's lovely. Yeah. Mm. Is that a winner? Mm. Is that a really a, a lovely winner? Mm. Yeah. Mm. So apple scones, mm. sour cream, mm. a little bit of honey drizzled in mm. there, glass of prosecco. Mm. What more do you want on a summy, summy? <laughs> Sunny Sunday afternoon. Afternoon. 
You're in heaven, aren't you? Mm. Okay. Yeah. So, there you go. Um, thumbs up? Mm. Definitely thumbs up. Uh, and if you think that it's worth giving us a thumbs up, please do. Really appreciate it. Hit that red button and subscribe, because the more subscribe, the more of these wonderful things we can do for you. Uh, don't forget, this is the Ninja Wood Fire. We're cooking outside. Mm. We've just cooked apple scones. Mm. I would never have thought we could have done that outside. Mm. Absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, and that's it. Um, tell your friends. Let us know how you get on. If you've got any other recipes, let us know. Mm. And what was that query you had earlier? Can't remember. Can't remember now, can you? Flour. Flour. What's the difference between self-raising and plain flour? Yeah, and why, and why do you use self-raising yeah. flour and stuff? Yeah, good idea. Mm. All right, got to our age. Who would have thought we never knew those mm. things? Thank you very much for watching. We really, really appreciate it. And bye for now.